What Gail Kirkham thought was just an innocent insect bite turned out to be a deadly tumour which could have cost her her life. Gail was diagnosed with cancer in September 2013, but since last month she was told she was cancer free and is forever thankful for the support from her family, friends and the team at the One Stop Breast Clinic at Salford Royal. They tell you you've got cancer my husband was absolutely phenomenal, he just kept in control as much as say, we're going to get through this. Went to pieces a bit and then a walk out and then Kath's there. And she picks you back up and she explains everything to you and she says, it's, you know, it's a journey. The Salford mother of three is now on a mission to raise awareness of the symptoms of breast cancer. And this Valentine's Day, she hosted a Fifty Shades of Pink fundraising event, which followed a masquerade theme. Even during her most traumatic times with the cancer, Gail has organised fundraising events throughout the year, with this Fifty Shades of Pink event being organised since January 2014. Time to get my mask on. The event was a huge success and featured a jazz band, a raffle, and Coronation Street's Kim Marsh's dress was even up for bids. £2,000 was raised on the night, and with money still coming in, Gail is hoping to reach a much higher total in support of the One Stop Breast Clinic at Salford Royal and to help fundraise for a help desk. Whatever changes have happened in the breasts for that person, they will have that fear is this cancer. When people come to the breast clinic, we need to try and relieve that anxiety. We try to act as normally as we can. We try to make sure that our communication with the patient is spot on and that they know exactly what we're doing and get them the results as quickly as we can. Having battled through her cancer, she's now making the most of every day and is already planning her next fundraising event this summer. You learn to live every day to its full. And that's all I can say, just do it and enjoy it because life's worth living. Sometimes it sets a kick up the backside to realise how much it's worth living. Carly Foster, Keys TV News, Salford.